hello friends welcome back to my channel harchi creations in this video i would like to describe a very pretty knitting stitch pattern from the right side it looks like this and from the wrong side it looks like this friends this pattern can be used for making a any knitting project like sweater jacket blanket etc it is a 12 rows repeat knitting pattern and stitches needed for cast on are the multiple of 10 plus 2 f stitches so let's start the tutorial friends before starting the tutorial if you really like my video then please don't forget to subscribe my channel and press the bell icon to receive the notification of the upcoming video Friends, please also hit the like button and share my video with your friends in your groups and keep supporting me. Thank you. Friends, here I have cast on 32 stitches on my needle. 30 multiple of 10 plus 2 as stitches. So, let's start the first row of the pattern right side. Slip the add stitch. After that, our pattern will be start in the pattern is knit 6 stitches 1 2 3 4 5 and 6 knit 6 stitches after that we will make one stitch we will insert a needle just after these two stitches 1 and 2 insert a needle here the space after these two stitches insert a needle here like this and pull one loop like this now we will knit these two stitches together through the back loop Again, we will make a loop just before these two stitches 1 and 2. Insert a needle here like this and make one loop like this. Now knit these two stitches together through the back loop. So we will repeat this pattern in the whole row and repeat pattern is knit 6 then make one loop knit two stitches together through the back loop again make one loop and knit two stitches together through the back loop. So one more repeat is knit 6 stitches 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 6 knit 6 then make one loop by inserting a needle here the space after these two stitches insert a needle here like this and pull one loop like this then knit these two stitches together through the back loop like this again make a loop by inserting a needle here the space after these two stitches insert a needle here like this and make one loop like this then knit two stitches together through the back loop like this one more repeat knit six stitches one two three four five and six knit six stitches then pull a loop by inserting a needle after these two stitches one and two insert a needle here the space after the two stitches and pull one loop like this then knit two stitches together through the back loop like again pull a loop by inserting a needle here like this and make one loop like this now knit these two stitches together through the back loop like this 
so in this way we will complete our first row of the pattern last is edge stitch knit the edge stitch second row wrong side slip the edge stitch after that purl all the stitches in the second row friends all wrong side rows will be same by purl all the stitches so let's complete this row by purl all the stitches third row slip the add stitch after that our pattern will be start and the pattern is knit five stitches one two three four five knit five now we will pull a loop from here insert a needle just after these two stitches one and two insert a needle here like this and pull one loop like this now knit these two stitches together through the back loop like this again insert a needle the space after the two stitches one and two insert a needle here like this and pull one loop like this now knit these two stitches together through the back loop then yarn in front and purl one stitch so we will repeat this pattern in the whole row and repeat pattern is knit 5, pull a loop, knit 2 stitches together through the back loop, pull a loop, knit 2 stitches together through a back loop, purl 1 stitch. So one more repeat is yarn in back, knit 5 stitches, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 knit 5 then pull a loop after these two stitches 1 and 2 insert a needle here and pull a loop like this now knit these two stitches together through the back loop like this again pull a loop after these two stitches 1 and 2 insert a needle here and pull one loop like this now knit these two stitches together through the back loop like this then yarn in front and purl one stitch one more repeat yarn in back knit five stitches one two three four five knit five then pull a loop by inserting a needle into the space after these two stitches so insert a needle here like this and pull one loop like this now knit two stitches together through the back loop like this again pull a loop by inserting a needle after these two stitches one and two insert a needle here like this and pull one loop now knit two stitches together through the back loop like this yarn in front and purl one stitch last is edge stitch yarn in back knit the add stitch fourth row we will purl all the stitches in the fourth row fifth row slip the add stitch after that our pattern will be start and the pattern is knit four stitches one two three and four knit four now insert a needle here the space after these two stitches and pull one loop like this now knit two stitches together through the back loop again insert a needle here the space after these two stitches one and two insert a needle here like this and pull one loop now knit two stitches together through the back loop like this yarn in front and pull two stitches one and two so we will repeat this pattern in the whole row and repeat pattern is knit four make one loop then 
knit two stitches together through the back loop make one loop knit two stitches together through the back loop then purl two stitches so one more repeat is yarn in back knit four stitches one two three and four knit four then make one loop insert a needle here the space after the two stitches and pull a loop like this now knit these two stitches together through the back loop like this again insert a needle here one and two the space after the two stitches so insert a needle here like this now knit these two stitches together through the back loop then yarn in front and pull two stitches one and two one more repeat yarn in back knit four stitches one two three and four knit four then make one loop by inserting a needle into the space after the two stitches like this now knit two stitches together through the back loop again make a loop here by inserting a needle like this knit two stitches together through the back loop yarn in front pull two stitches one and two last is edge stitch yarn in back knit the edge stitch sixth row we will purl all the stitches in the sixth row seventh row slip the edge stitch after that our pattern will be start and the pattern is knit three stitches one two and three knit three then again insert a needle into the space after the two stitches and pull one loop like this now knit these two stitches together through the back loop again pull one loop by inserting a needle here space after these two stitches one and two insert a needle here and pull one loop like this now knit these two stitches together through the back loop like this then yarn in front and purl three stitches one two and three so we will repeat this pattern in the whole row repeat pattern is knit three make one loop knit two stitches together through the back loop make one loop knit two stitches together through the back loop and purl three stitches so one more repeat is yarn in back knit three stitches one two and three then pull one loop by inserting a needle here the space after the two stitches like this then knit two stitches together through the back loop again insert a needle here and pull one loop knit two stitches together through the back loop yarn in front pull three stitches one two and three one more repeat is yarn in back knit three stitches one two and three knit three then make one loop by inserting a needle here the space after the two stitches and make one loop like this now knit these two stitches together through the back loop again insert a needle here the space after the two stitches and pull one loop then knit two stitches together through the back loop like this then yarn in front and pull three stitches one two and three last is edge stitch yarn in back knit the edge stitch eighth row we will purl all the stitches in the eighth row ninth row slip the edge stitch after that our pattern will be start and the pattern is knit two stitches one and two 
after that pull one loop by inserting a needle here the space after these two stitches one and two insert a needle here like this and pull one loop like this then knit two stitches together through the back loop like this again pull a loop by inserting a needle into the space after the two stitches like this then knit two stitches together through the back loop like this then yarn in front and pull four stitches one two three and four so we will repeat this pattern in the whole row and the repeat pattern is knit two make one loop knit two stitches together through the back loop make one loop knit two stitches together through the back loop pull four stitches one more repeat is yarn in back knit two one and two then pull one loop by inserting a needle into the space after the two stitches like this then knit two stitches together through the back loop again pull one loop by inserting a needle after the two stitches then knit two stitches together through the back loop one and two knit two stitches together through the back loop yarn in front purl four stitches one two three and four purl four stitches so one more repeat is yarn in back knit two one and two then pull a loop by inserting a needle here the space after these two stitches like this then knit two stitches together through the back loop again pull a loop by inserting a needle into the space after these two stitches like this then knit two stitches together through the back loop like this yarn in front purl four stitches one two three and four last is edge stitch yarn in back knit the edge stitch tenth row we will purl all the stitches in the tenth row eleventh row slip the edge stitch after that pattern will be start and pattern is knit to one like this now pull one loop by inserting a needle into a space after the two stitches like this now knit these two stitches together through the back loop like this again pull a loop by inserting a needle here the space after the two stitches like this knit two stitches together through a back loop like this then yarn in front and purl five stitches one two three four five we will repeat this pattern in the whole row repeat pattern is knit one make one loop knit two stitches together through the back loop make one loop knit two stitches together through a back loop purl five stitches so one more repeat is yarn in back knit to one now make one loop by inserting a needle into a space after the two stitches like this now knit these two stitches together through a back loop again make one loop by inserting a needle into a space after the two stitches like this now knit these two stitches together through a back loop one and two knit two stitches together through a back loop like this yarn in front purl five stitches one two three four and five 
so one more repeat is yarn in back knit to one then make one loop by inserting a needle into a space after two stitches then knit two stitches together through a back loop again make one loop by inserting a needle into a space after the two stitches knit two stitches together through a back loop yarn in front purl five stitches one two three four five yarn in back knit the end stitch 12th row we will purl all the stitches in the 12th row so let's complete this row by purl all the stitches so friends after the 12 rows our pattern is ready like this we will repeat these 12 rows over and over again until the desired length of our pattern friends i hope you will like my video thank you for watching my video and enjoying knitting with us